Hey everybody, I'm Betsy. Thanks for joining me for another tutorial on I Breathe I DIY. Today I'm putting together a galvanized garden bed and then stay tuned to the end I'll give you my initial review of what I think. I purchased this whole thing as a kit and the one that I ordered is actually 17 inches tall because I'm tired of fighting with the rabbits. Now this came with all of the galvanized panels and the corner pieces. Now there were six total bolts that ended up going into each one of those corners, three in each panel, and it really seemed like it was going to be pretty secure once I fill it with dirt. As an added bonus, the company included wing nuts to be able to secure all of the bolts that hold together that galvanized frame, which made it super easy for me to put together all by myself. The garden bed I'm putting together is a rectangle, so it had an extension kit that provided braces. Now, I thought that it just came with the one brace across the top to keep it from bowing out, but it actually came with three of them that you attach into that extension kit, which will definitely help keep it stable for years to come. You can, of course, choose any shape or size that you like. I did get the taller version. They make a shorter version as well. There were several sizes and shapes to choose from. I chose to put together a couple of larger garden beds. These seem like they're going to be a very permanent solution to uh, the rabbit issue that we have where we live. The height, of course, will help keep other animals like dogs out as well. As you can see, I'm trying to work quickly because there's definitely a storm blowing in. All right, what are my initial thoughts about this raised bed? I think I made a really good purchase when I bought these. They were very easy to put together. They're galvanized steel, so they should last a very long time. They have three bolts on each one of those panels that hold it into the corner, and it seems pretty secure. It has the three braces that go across the middle to prevent it from bowing. And overall, this was so easy to put together. I was able to get two of them put together before it started snowing. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial and my initial review of this galvanized garden bed kit. I'm Betsy, and thanks for joining me on I Breathe I DIY. Be sure and check out my website at ibreatheidiy.com.